Hi, I am Grace McPhillips. I am the executive producer of The Other One, and I am also starring in that feature film. And I want to talk with you today a little bit about independent financing. <laughs> it's a mystery, it's a weird game, and there's many ways to do it. Um, our film actually chose the route of fiscal sponsorship, and a lot of people have been asking me questions about fiscal sponsorship and crowdfunding, and while I'm not an expert at it, we've gone through it once, we're about to go through it again, and I want to share with you some of the ideas that we've had that seem to have worked and that could help you on your projects. Fiscal sponsorship is basically when a not-for-profit comes along and supports an artist with a unique project and helps that artist bring money through their 501c3 so that all the money donated for that project actually becomes a charitable tax deductible donation. Now the partnering organization that I am working with is Fractured Atlas. It's an art service organization out of New York City. I've been very happy with them and um, in addition to being the fiscal receiver, they also set up a website for you. They help you um, keep in touch with your donors. They help you see your total. They also um, help help you keep all of your ducks in a row because you have to submit expenses to have the money released, which is really actually kind of a, it's a good thing. It's a really good way to keep track of all your finances because Lord knows money will just fly out the window sometimes when you're making a movie. Also, crowdfunding. There are some crowd funds out there that do work with partnered organizations uh, like Fractured Atlas and some that don't. Kickstarter, for example, doesn't. They All the money that is given um, to an artist or a movie, etc., through Kickstarter is considered a gift. It's not tax deductible donations. Um, unless that's changed and I, I will make that disclaimer now. But Indiegogo, for example, actually partners with several of these organizations, including Fractured Atlas. And so Indiegogo will waive their fees and help all of my funders come together on one unique platform um, while we do a campaign. And, um, and that actually worked out really well for us. We ended up raising, um, I believe, $17,300 through our Indiegogo campaign. And at the same time while that was going on, um, some people just chose not to contribute through Indiegogo. They just wanted to write a check separately. Or um, you can I even transfer funds from stocks, which is pretty cool, into Fractured Atlas's secure online uh, donation. See? This is fiscal sponsorship through Fractured Atlas. So we were actually able to raise $25,618, and that ended up being a huge, huge boost to our film and allowed us to go into production, um, especially because we had gotten some equipment donations, we had location donations, and frankly, when all of that is coming your way, you just have to jump. That's how it is, so we did it. Creative marketing is also a really important strategy when you are going to do crowdfunding. So partnering with other organizations, even letter writing campaigns to your aunt and your grandmother and your friend from summer camp, um, everything adds up in a crowdfund. Uh, that's exactly what it's about. Whether it's one dollar, whether it's five thousand dollars, if people come together and give what they can, amazing things can happen. So we are actually going to be launching into our second fundraising campaign now. And, um, and basically, we've bet on ourselves. So we're going to keep going through this, and I'm sure we still have a lot of lessons to learn. Um, but at the same time, if you have any questions about fiscal sponsorship, please feel free to email us um, through our Facebook page. You can also subscribe to our newsletter right there on our Facebook page. And our newsletter is not a do not reply. When we send it out, <laughs> you can absolutely reply, and those messages come directly to me. And I will try to answer any questions or point you in the direction. <laughs> Yeah, it's been a great process. I definitely encourage you to explore fiscal sponsorship. It was something that was right for this film. It's not right for every film, but definitely in the independent world, um, there's some really great resources out there for you. Also, by the way, being fiscally sponsored allows you to apply for grants. Get ready to write a lot of grants and apply to a lot of them because lots of people are applying for them. The odds are against you, but you're at least getting the opportunity to even apply. And you don't get that 
unless you're fiscally sponsored.